Damn it. Breakers. Hello? Mr. Demet? Might be time to join the 21st century, guys. Creepy maintenance room in the creepy hotel on the creepy island to shoot a doc about serial killers all alone and without my stun gun. Choices, Jamie. Make better choices. This is your own damn fault. God, something from this century.
Attention. Attention. This is a severe weather storm warning for the Greater Lakes area. Hot winds and heavy rainfall. How are we looking, Jamie? Little electrical drama, but we're about good to go. This looks great. Very gaslight. Mm, if we had a grip with some foil, I could get a good flicker effect going. This would be fine. I just got a bit more to do once Kate's standing there. Shouldn't be more than a few minutes. Hey, thanks for that stuff you said at dinner. It was nice to hear. We're all on the same side. Sometimes we forget. <coughs> what the hell? Somebody's in here with, with me. Oh, God. Not here. 
Obviously. But there's no one in here. Where is she? I told you so. Aaron? Aaron! Then she found a way out. There must be a door or a hatch or something. Way out. how Jamie will take the news just when they seem to recognize how they felt about each other. Now, where's our wayward host, Mr. Dumet? Apparently, he's left the island. How very rude not to stay for dinner. Charlie managed to rally the troops, though, and a good thing. The road ahead is full of challenges. I can only observe and it can be frustrating to watch. In some ways, I envy you. I only record events. You get to shape them. You'd better get back to things before one of our friends makes a poor choice on their own. Where the hell is she? She's got to be around here somewhere. She has to be. Yeah. I'm sure there's a simple explanation. This place is like a maze. She's just turned around somewhere and... And screaming her ass off? You all heard her. Something bad has happened. You don't know that. Bullshit. You just don't want to let this shoot go, Charles. I, on the other hand, have no problem with that. Something is very not right here. Let's just find Aaron and get the hell off this island. Everyone relax, OK? Just give me a second to think. Excuse you. And exit stage left, our oh-so-confident and sure leader. What was that? <laughs> Charlie is thinking. She looks a lot like a temper tantrum. Maybe he's right. If we don't crush this episode, we're all screwed. Are you kidding me? What? I'm just I've saying. been waiting on you for ages to actually make a decision about something, anything. And now this is when you suddenly choose to take a stand? So the show is more important than the fat Aaron is missing? No way, Mark, come on. We find her and we leave. You're jumping to conclusions. Mark, I don't know what's made the two of you suddenly swap perspectives, but Kate is right. If the show goes down, we're all screwed. Yeah, don't care. I'm gonna find Aaron. Right. Here's the plan. We've already got a plan. It's leaving. Just listen. Look, let's just crack on with things. I'm going to go and find Dumet and square everything with him. I'm thinking after standing us up for dinner, I can guilt him into doing an interview. So Erin is on her own? She'll show up. Bravo, Charles. Your delusions make for such great plans. Dumet left. I saw it, remember? Maybe he's back now. Maybe he's not. Would it kill you to think positively just once? I guess as far as Charlie ideas go, it's not the worst he's ever had. It's not even the worst idea I've had this evening. Don't go patting yourself on the back. I still think your priorities are fucked. Whatever. I'm going. I'm coming with you. We're going to run around looking for Demet. Maybe we'll find Aaron, too. I don't care what he says. I'm done. I'm getting my shit together. Kate. I'm leaving, Mark. You coming or not? Yeah, absolutely. OK, genius. Where are we going to look first for Demet? I'm not looking for Demet. I'm scouting for shots. If he pops up along the way, great. Aaron has disappeared. How can you not care about that? I can care about more than one thing at a time. Wow. You know, working this job has made me really understand what a sociopath is. Well, our show is educational. <sighs> Asshole.
What happened here? I... No idea. Aaron! Can you hear me? Can you warn me before you start shouting? I'm starting to freak out. We barely looked. Yeah, but she's been gone a long time now. Erin! For all we know, she and Dumet are outside having a smoke. She has asthma. She's not smoking. You know what I mean. We'll find her. This looks pretty old. Wait, what? The hell? Huh? No power. Jamie, over here. Okay, yeah, I'm freaking the fuck out. It's just blood. Just blood? Are you kidding me? You're jumping to conclusions. Or maybe this is from Aaron. Stop it. You always assume the worst. All we know is something was dragged along this way and it was bleeding. And that's not a cause for concern to you? All right, it's a little odd. Odd? What do you want me to say? Look, it's probably just Dumet or the groundskeeper dragging in some dead animal from outside. Maybe it's our dinner. Welcome, one and all, to tonight's entertainment. Oh, what the fuck? Presented by Grantham Dumet. Dumet? What? So he hasn't left.
Help. The fuck? Help me. Please. Please. Are you? I'll do anything. What happened? Are you okay? What the fuck? Stop. Look. What is this? It's a fucking booby trap. You shift your weight off that plate. And this guy is getting run through by that thing. spirit crystal don't do that and don't make fun of me sorry wouldn't want you to cut yourself the rock is sharp as hell and now super magical it's an amethyst crystal it helps keep you calm by blanketing you in protective energy i know i remember if you know then don't call it a rock maybe i just feel like you should take responsibility of your own emotions and stop outsourcing the job to a crystal Maybe you're right. But you don't have to be an asshole about it. Okay, maybe that was a shitty thing to say. I'm sorry. It's fine. This isn't the time or place to... I have to tell you something. Okay. Earlier, you brought up that DP job I blew off. I never told you the truth about it. About what? It wasn't a job, not really. What are you talking about? Remember my friend Murray? He was setting up a studio in Brooklyn, Fine Arts. He wanted a partner. That's your dream. Yeah. There is exactly zero money to made, so I thought you'd tell me it was insane, rightfully. Because it would be. Wait, I mean, did you ever think maybe of chasing the dream first and making it work practically second? Clearly not. I'm here, aren't I? Things are already starting to get tough for us. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't put any of this on me. This is all you. I know. I turned it down because it would have taken me away from you. I guess I didn't even think of that. I... 
I just... Uh, what do you want me to say? Because I was holding out for things to change with it. Deep down, I'm still hoping. You should have said all this before. I know. I'm not going through it all again. What if this time is different? Oh, come on. That's not likely, and you know it. Sorry. I guess I'm a little confused. We better go. Let's find Aaron and get the fuck out of here. Do you think they found your men? I don't care. I'm more interested in finding Aaron, which I'm sure Charles is not concerned with. Why do you call him that? What? Charles? Because he hates it, obviously. Wonder how much pure amethyst is going for online these days. That. Is this somebody's idea of a fucking joke? How is this here? Did you bring this? No. Is that her? Yeah. Shelby. Matching nails? God, don't. We always got them done the same. That's him. What? That's him. The guy in the back. You know him? I kind of did. He was just one of those guys that was always around. We'd be at some of the same parties, but that's it. It was my fault. You know that's not true. The night it happened, I was supposed to meet her. We were going to grab some drinks, go to a party. I slept through. There's a big deal on campus not to go out on your own. Shelby waited for me when I didn't show, and. That's when, that's when he got her. It's okay. It's not fucking okay. It can't be. I have to live with it every day, and now someone knows. Someone wanted me to find this. What the hell is that? I have no idea. But I feel like it's bad. What the hell? Get over here, now. Charlie! <laughs> 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 I can't hold this. You have to get the fuck out any way you can. Just get the fuck out now! Jamie! Charlie! What the hell just happened? I, I don't know. But I think it's really, really bad. That has to be the way to have. Yeah, maintenance corridors, crawl space, has to be. Uh, What's going on? So Matt, what the hell is going on with him? He was nervous the whole way here. I chalked it up to him just being eccentric. There's a lot of miles between eccentric and murderous. Let's think about this. You saw Dumet take off. So maybe he found out there was a killer and bugged out? Maybe. Or perhaps the man we met wasn't actually Dumet. And the dude in the mask is? Motherfucker. What? Brick wall. Keep going. Just like Holmes. I know. I don't want to think about it. Fucking traption. That's a hell of a lot to set up. 
That was planned out, every bit of it. It was set up for us to find. Which makes it even more likely the dude on the ferry wasn't really the Met. Trying to map this in my head. But I think Erin's room has been completely cut off. Jesus, Charlie. Why is he messing with her? Because she's the most easily frightened. The most vulnerable. Don't you watch our show? That's what these sociopaths do. Oh, what the fuck? Is that a kid? Oh, good. You hear creepy kid voice, too. I was worried I was finally snapping. Where's it coming from? Charlie, come here. Let's get this open. We're in a bloody nesting doll. What? A Russian nesting doll. You know? A doll in a doll in a doll. Are you losing your shit? Because I don't need that right now. We're locked in a kitchen, trapped in a hotel, stranded on an island. Even if we get out of this room... How do we get out of the hotel? Exactly. Or off the island. Charlie! I found a way out, maybe. Look, this one swings out. We can probably force it easier than the others. Stand back. That's not what I was expecting. Ah, Amy! Ah! Charlie? Fuck. Charlie? Jamie? Hello? Aaron? Keep it down. Where could she be? She can't have just vanished. Mark, come over here. What is going on? <clears throat> are, are we locked in here? Looks like it, yeah. Wait. Shh. What? You hear that? Is that them? Where is it coming from? Somebody's in the restaurant. I know that I'm the butt of your jokes, and that's just my cross to bear as the patriarch of our little family. Mark and Jamie, the two of you do the work of a team of ten. And Kate, despite our bickering, you are the heart of this show. You keep people interested. What the fuck is this? Stay back from it. Relax. So, it's a bunch of mannequins dressed like us. Weird? Yes. Cause to lose your shit? No. Has anyone seen Mr. Dumet?
Jesus. It looks just like him. No way somebody just threw these together in the last couple hours. Okay, this is fucked up. What the hell is going on? You hear that? Footsteps. And they're getting closer. <laughs> 